Hey everybody, Space Cadet here. Thanks for joining me. So I just got these felt ukulele picks and they were interesting to me because they're supposed to minimize the volume, the sound of the actual ukulele. And I felt as though in some songs, my I couldn't hear myself sing. The ukulele was overpowering my voice. So I was interested in these. And aside from these, we're also going to try some other picks the, that are different thicknesses and different materials. And we're going to see which one, how each one sounds. All right, let's do it. We're going to start off with the thinnest pick and work our way up to the thickest, which the felt ones are actually the thickest looking ones, even though they'll hopefully be the quietest. This real flimsy one, it's uh, 0.5 millimeters, and you can literally just bend it like a, like a thin fingernail. I'm just going to play House of Gold by 21 Pilots. Just a little sample of it. Pretty popular Uke songs. She asked me, his son, when I grow old, will you buy me a house of gold? And when your father turns to stone, will you take care of flimsy one kind of had like a twang to it maybe that little bounce back from how it's so flexible but uh, let's go ahead and move on to the next one here we got a 0.71 this one's triangular but it's still still very thin still able to bend it just like that let's see how this one sounds she asked me son when i grow old will you buy me a house of gold and when your father turns to stone, will you take care of me? Surprisingly enough, I could actually really hear the difference in the volume just between those two, between the 0.5 and the 0.71. Next one we're moving on to is a 0.96. I love these little rice ball picks. If you ever see them online, I definitely recommend them. Let's see how it sounds. She asked me, son, when I grow old, will you buy me a house of gold? And when your father turns to stone, will you take care of me? Now the point nine six is definitely where I felt like I had to start singing louder to keep up with how loud the ukulele was with at almost one millimeter and also that's when they start to be harder to bend uh you could still bend it but now we've got this is the smallest jump so far from 0.96 to 1.0 millimeters so one millimeter probably your standard guitar pick so let's see how this one sounds she asked me son when i grow So between those last two, <clears throat> I didn't hear too much volume difference, which is kind of what I expected, but I did feel a difference when I was playing with them just because this one is less bendable than this one between the, the 0.96 and the 0.1. Now we're going to make another big jump up to 1.5. These ones I like, I like to use them when I use a pick to play bass sometimes. Pretty much unable to bend it. You're going to have to work pretty hard to bend this one, but we'll see how it sounds on the ukulele. She asked me, son, when I grow old, will you buy me a house of gold? And when your father turns to stone, will you take care of me? I'd say with that one, definitely a volume difference. And I know I'm still just using plastic ones at this point, but the one really notable thing again is the way it feels when you're playing is different. With the 1.5, I felt like I was barely having to hit the strings. If you have a weak wrist and you have a problem with your strumming hand, get a thicker pick because it was really easy. Barely had to touch it, it felt like. So now we're going to move on to one of a different material. This one is a wooden pick and it will not bend because it is made of wood. 
It's a custom pick that my wife got for me a while back. It says, I fucking love you, Sean. It's really cute. I've noticed before when I use it, that it has a particularly warm quality to the sound, if that makes sense to you guys. It's probably almost twice as thick as the 1.5, so it's almost a 3, really. But it's made of wood. So we'll see how this one sounds on our ukulele. Wood. She asked me, son, when I grow old, will you buy me a house of gold? And when your father turns to stone, will you take care of me? So that was cool. Very much the feel of it was a lot like the 1.5 because of the thickness. But what I found different wasn't so much the volume as it was the timbre or the quality of sound what makes one sound different from another again it felt like a warmer quality of sound to me with the wooden pick whereas with the plastic pick felt a little more twangy so warm twangy and we've got we got more to try so yeah the next pick we've got is actually made out of flesh and bone and it's my finger a lot of people use their fingers when they play the ukulele, so we're just gonna hear how this one sounds too. She asked me, son, when I grow old, will you buy me a house of gold? And when your father turns to stone, will you take care of me? I would say with the finger, again, the timbre uh, was different. It uh, had a warmer quality than the plastic pick, I felt like but not quite as much as the wooden one. Also, just how you strike it when it, when you're using your fingers is going to make a difference. How hard you slap the thing or whether you're using your the pads of your fingers or your nails, it's going to sound different volume and timbre. So keep that in mind if you're using your fingers. Next thing I have here is a twice-folded business card. I've seen people do this at parties when they don't have a pick. Kind of novelty. We'll see how it sounds. She asked me, son, when I grow old, will you buy me a house of gold? And when your father turns to stone, will you take care of me? Wow, so I honestly, honestly thought that that was going to be cheap and tacky and hard to play with and sound bad, but... It sounded decent. So, in a pinch, twice folded business card makes a good pick for, you know, volume and timbre. Not bad for novelty's sake. Yeah, let's, let's see what's next. So just one more for novelty's sake before we get to the felt picks. Using a coin as a pick. So, we've kind of learned that the, that the material will affect the timbre more and the, the thickness uh, will just affect the volume more. So we're going to go with a quarter, U.S. quarter. It's probably most common for somebody to use as a pick in America if they were to use a coin. So let's see how this sounds on our ukulele strings. U.S. quarter. She asked me, son, when I grow old, will you buy me a house of gold? And when your father turns to stone, So again, I was pleasantly surprised that that sounded so good. With the quarter, it just kind of slides across the top of the strings. Doesn't quite pluck the strings, but it creates a particularly scratchy sound that you might be looking for for a certain song. So it could be something to experiment with pleasantly surprised with the quarter so we're finally going to get to uh why why i'm doing this video the felt picks never tried these before in my life only just heard of them a couple weeks ago honestly so we're gonna see how it sounds i'm excited all right let's do it i've got the felt picks and we're about to open them they came in a variety of colors always cool the different colors and stuff and a little carrying case for them which is good because i would lose them otherwise so we'll look at that later though Actually, I guess I'll look at it now. You can always cut it out and post if I, have, if I struggle with opening this. So the bag itself is um, felted, which is nice. 
got a little net on the back, put the stuff in there, and it's got a little pouch in the front, put more stuff in there. A pickle. You can use it for any kind of picks, really. A little bag to come with it. That's cool. Now we've got the actual picks themselves. Got a bunch of them here. 20 pieces. Here, my wife ordered them for me online, so so if you want to know where to get them, uh, post in the comments and I'll, I'll let you know. I got to find out myself. So, I finally pulled one out. It's a, I pulled out a red one, and they are 100% felt. They, you can bend them all the way like this. They bounce back pretty good, but there's nothing in the middle of them or anything. They are just a thick felt. And they're very thick, much thicker than the wooden one. Here's two nickels, uh, just for size comparison. That's about almost how thick they are. Almost two nickels thick. Oh, I dropped it. <laughs> All right. So. Here it is. Felt pick. Interesting. Cannot wait to hear that. All right. She asked me, son, when I grow old, will you buy me? Father turns to stone. Will you take care of me? She asked me, son, when I grow old, will you buy me a house of gold? And when your father turns to stone, will you take care of me? I'll put you on the map. I'll carry you up seas. Woo! Wow. So that was like no pick I had ever played with before. I felt like I could put all my energy and excitement of playing a song I liked into the strumming without having to really like strain my voice to yell over myself playing. That was really nice. Maybe not the best for all settings because it is hard to get extra volume out of it. One thing I will say is when I started strumming really fast, it almost felt like I was playing with my fingertips a little bit because when you use this, it, uh, it, it flexes very much, even more than the, the 0.5 pl plastic one. Like, you know, obviously you can bend that, but you can fold this. It almost folds on you when you're playing, and you will feel as you do the up and down, you kind of feel it on the tips of your fingers here as well. Wow, really cool. Buy them. Try them out. They're not, you know, they're not that expensive. Uh, give it a try. It can't hurt. Just uh something new you know it's cheaper than buying a new ukulele to get a new sound that's for sure so try out some different picks let me know if you have any questions this was this was a lot of fun so thank you so much for anybody who watched and like share subscribe check out more of our videos we'll see you next time thank you so much mm -hmm.